Hey, this is Blake from the Gig Harbor Fly Shop, and I recently tied up a bucktail uh, fly, pink over white, for uh, fishing for salmon, and that video is on YouTube. And so this is a follow-up to that one, and uh, and this is for the herring color, which is slightly different. And so just to go over some of the materials um, uh, real quickly, the SF Flash Blend, I love this stuff, and, uh, and it uses a mix of white on the bottom, with uh, with like a UV gray over the top. Um, and then I put some of this UV minnow belly on the white SF flash blend. Um, and then for the top part, we have uh, four materials that uh, we end up putting on there. There's a purple fluorofiber, uh, adds a little bit of purple color to it. Angel hair in electric, electric purple. The crystal flash in herringback color. And then we top it with, um, uh, with some peacock curl. So, um, so uh, we're gonna use a, an SC15 size one knot hook to help keel that fly. We'll have a stinger uh, hook on the back of it and we'll fish a size two or size four, usually size four. Um, and, um, and so here we go, step by step. Okay, I'm gonna start by placing my fire line. You can use super glue or some, just a little bit of UV flow on the thread wraps just to kind of lock everything in place. Okay, just tying in some diamond braid. I'm assuming you've watched the pink over white video, so some of the some of the different uh, reasons why explanations of of why I'm doing particular things I'm leaving out. Um, you know, for example, like why we're tying the material on the top of the hook and nothing underneath, uh, just so that that fly keels more. My SF flash blend in the white. I'm going to start with this. Usually I pull material through, but UV, the UV uh, minnow belly doesn't want to pull through the zip tie, so I just have to cut it. I just kind of pull it on the sides and underneath just a little bit. It's too, if stuff's too long, you can kind of trim it, but I like to trim after, after the fact. Okay, here's some SF Flash Blend in gray. Gonna be about the same length of the white or slightly longer. Okay, now that purple fluorofiber, I'm not gonna use a lot of this with that solid color that it has. I'm just gonna, just using a little bit. And then I roll my thumb on that material to kind of spread it out a little bit. I don't want it to end up on the sides, but it's probably good. It doesn't need to be much. Okay, so then now the UV herringback crystal flash. using quite a bit of this stuff. So I took about 10 strands and then doubled it back uh, over that purple. Now for that electric, um, electric purple angel hair. This angel hair looks, uh, inside it just looks gray, but when that sunlight hits it, it lights up and has this great purple, purple color to it. 
I use quite a bit of it. Okay, taking some peacock hurl. I'm just gonna pull some some of this over the top. That stinger hook, I always wait till the very end to put that thing on there. Just keeps it from uh, finding my finger. Okay, there it is. There's the uh, the herring salmon bucktail fly. It's a great fly for coho out in the salt water, and uh, I'll be fishing it this summer.